Hi everyone, this is a reading with me. I hope you are doing well. It's me, Moonlight Guidance. I feel like if you are here, it's a really big sign that there are messages for you. So we will take a look, see what's coming through. And this is also a very, very safe space where you are always very, very welcome. And I just wanted to mention before I get started that if you are ever interested in any personal readings, services, um, or intention items which have thousands of five star reviews, everything is always linked in the description box below and on shopmoonlightguidance.com. All right, let's begin with your reading and see what's coming through. The sun is truly shining, which I think is just such a nice thing because it was snowing. It was literally snowing and it's so cold, hence my outfit. <laughs> so let's see. Wow, Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune, okay, came out with the star card, which is honestly your stars are aligning. This is Jupiter. Jupiter is to do with wealth and success and wealth in terms of money, but also wealth in terms of peace, wealth in terms of good energy, wealth in terms of good health, you know, because um, these are things that are truly priceless, actually. And Jupiter is not just about money. Everyone always calls it the money planet. And, you know, money is important in life. But also there are other important things as well, which money cannot buy, you know, which is like peace, happiness, good sleep, um, good relationships. So the most amazing thing about this is that you are going to have a lot of wealth and success in multiple areas of your life, especially with things that are extremely priceless, right? You cannot buy certain things in life. And those are the kinds of things which are a true blessing that are going to come your way. Um, that's amazing. Like that is literally amazing. I am so happy if you are watching this because I feel like you deserve it. You've worked so hard. And in fact, that actually does show through here with the Knight of Wands. You're a very hardworking, proactive person that's always trying to make things work. You're always trying to do things. You're always trying to, you know, um, figure out situations, be the right person for others. Um, you're always trying to help other people. You're always trying to give advice or, you know, help when people need it. So I feel like there's a really beautiful energy, especially with the star, if your stars aligning, you're starting to feel stronger. And I also feel here as well, there's a real deep healing that takes place. So if you've been dealing a lot with past trauma, childhood trauma, heartbreak, grief, sad, loss of a loved one, whether it's, you know, um, physical death or whether it's, um, you know, through a relationship, a breakup, something like that. Um, there's a real sense of deep healing that allows you to finally feel at peace. But not only do you feel at peace because, you know, those emotions can um, come, you know, creep up a little bit, but you are able to uh, accept and handle and still not let it affect the other things in your life. And it's just a real sense of peace and happiness and confidence in your life that is the driving force like you're going to feel so much more confident and uplifted like when you see the sun shine you'll be like i'm so grateful the sun is shining and it's warm and you'll feel it on your your hand and you'll just think to yourself like i'm so i feel so good and you know when it's sort of a hot day and you feel a breeze like you will just feel um this sense of just happiness I, I can't put it but it's like little things will also make you feel very happy because what i see right now is little things might make you a little bit irritated right but it's almost like the thing, it turns, it turns to a point where it's a 180, that's the wheel of fortune as well, where little things actually make you feel happy, you know, and um, it's not that, like every little thing on the planet is going to obviously make you feel happy, it's just that you're going to become less irritated, you will become less frustrated with certain people, and you will also become much more happier, which means that you'll be less frustrated at other things that maybe you be more frustrated with you know because life is about duality humans have emotions everyone has you know things that they get frustrated by or annoyed by but i just feel like it's been triggering you so much to the point where sometimes you feel just not like yourself the most amazing thing here is that you will feel like yourself that's the hierophant okay this is you feeling most like yourself this is self-love within yourself being able to communicate your feelings which is taurus this is throat chakra energies but just feeling good, you know, and just not feeling overwhelmed or consumed deeply by emotion, but instead feeling happier in your own energy, more content within your own energy, fulfilled in your own energy, and feeling like things are moving rather than things are stopping you or things are going, you know, haywire. So there's a real sense here of things just getting better and better. And let's have a look more into the relationship side of things because I feel naturally that the Hierophant is going in that direction. So we've got Page of Pentacles. Wow.
You know, when it comes to love, you have options and choices. There isn't just one person for you in this lifetime. And I know that, you know, there's that whole thing about the chosen, well, not the chosen one, sorry, the one, the one. The one is known as the chosen one, okay? There is a reason why certain people get into certain relationships and then let's say they go through a divorce, unfortunately, or a breakup, and then they find, you know, who they believe is the one. So that's the thing about life is there isn't just one person for each person. Um, did you know that there can be multiple soulmates? I bet some of you may only thought that there's only one soulmate. You know, there's also twin flames, there's karmics, there's people that you can literally have a relationship with for life who you may not even have a spiritual connection with, like a, you know, they might not be a soulmate or a twin flame. Um, people go into relationship with karmics, you know. So what's really quite significant and really, really important in this entire situation is to know that you have options and choices with who you can be with in this lifetime. There isn't just one person for you. And so if you find yourself clinging on to one person and then accepting, you know, how they treat you and it's not nice, just always know that you have options and choices, okay? And who you choose to be with is your choice because they are the one, they're the chosen one for you. But if you're in a situation right now where if you're being abused or you're being treated really disrespectfully and someone's not treating you well, they're not being kind to you, just know that you do have options and choices. And that's really important for me to tell you this, okay? Because if you're completely single right now, um, you will be pursued. And there are two people, two suitors that I see here. Um, one is more fiery in nature. They like to do things. They always like to stay very busy. The other one is much more sort of like grounded, like family orientated and you know, they, they really focus on matters of the home. So there's one person that's more outdoors and one person that's a little bit more indoors, more, you know, homely. They come back from work and they just, you know, or if they work at home, they're more of a homebody. Whereas the other person's more of an outdoors. They like to do things, they like to socialize, they like to meet people, you know, they like to get on with work, but also they're just very, they like to fill their time up with a lot of things, a lot of activities. So there's two, there's two people there. Ace of Cups shows that you will not be without love in this lifetime, so please don't panic, please don't worry, please don't think to yourself, Moonlight, I'm going to be alone for the rest of my life. Not true, okay? Not true. Repeat after me. That is not true. Okay, so this is really important here is that you will have overflowing emotion in terms of happiness and joy. You will have so much love, so much fulfillment, so much more of a content energy. You will feel so happy. Um, you will not be without a companion or a life partner or love in this lifetime. It is yours. It will happen. If you see a lot of repeating ones okay this means that what you desire will manifest in terms of your highest good okay so you know the universe knows what you truly want sometimes you know or you think you know what you want the universe really knows what you want okay so if you want true love but then you're accepting literal breadcrumbs from a person that's like not doing anything towards you the universe, okay, can then bring in a new person that's much better for you, for example. So that's the thing here is that what you truly want in terms of your internal desires, not what you're just accepting, and what the universe believes that you deserve will absolutely manifest. And that's the power of the number one. So if you see a lot of 11 11s, um, if you see a lot of 10 10s, for example, because that's got the number one in it as well, it really showcases here that your true desires, your heart's desires, okay, will manifest. Okay. <laughs> so let's keep going. So that was love. Let's see what else other areas of your life we can look into. Wow. Wow. If you want a family, it's absolutely there. Marriage is absolutely there as well. And um, this is also about a beautiful home as well and having a home, having a family, having, um, you know, really a companion, someone that's committed to you, someone that loves you, someone that cares for you, someone that respects you, understands you, is there for you. There is a beautiful energy of this really being um, present. You know, this person is present, this person is there, this person is you know, it's, it's really making things happen. It's, it's really working in such a positive um, direction. And also with the chariot as well, I just see that there's just such an amazing energy here, especially with the chariot, which shows that um, there's a real sense of healing in the family as well. So that's something that I also see taking place and also healing in terms of friendship. So if you found that you've had friends that may be a bit wishy-washy or they're not so proactive or they're not really there for you all the time. This is about friends that show up, turn up, that never talk behind your back. They emotionally understand you. They validate you. If you have a problem, they sort of like drop as much as they can to, you know, be with you. And also with the six of cups as well, there's just such a lovely energy here of 
you know, having um, a romantic partner who like values you and trusts you and understands you, but also someone that you trust as well. And, you know, little gifts and a real sense of thoughtful nature is what I'm picking up on. So a real sense of thoughtfulness, a real sense of understanding and a real sense of care um, without like running away or being disrespectful or being rude. You know, this is like someone that like really cares and really understands and really knows how to treat you and then also we've got the world here as well so you will feel so satisfied that you will feel like you're literally floating and that you are just not being touched by negative things you know and to such a degree as before and that's amazing like really the world card is also saturn so it also shows karma like right now if you're feeling overwhelmed stressed you feel a lot of pain and sadness you're burning a lot of karma from your past life that was generated which i know sounds really unfair like why would you deal with that in this lifetime but it's one of those things can't control it i'm just your messenger there's some karma from your past lifetime that you had to burn in this lifetime but once it's burned so much more happiness, so much more joy and so much more fulfillment comes your way and it really just brings so much more peace and optimism and happiness into your life, which is amazing. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get some oracle cards out but before I do I just wanted to mention that if you ever wanted to purchase a personal reading with me they are always on my website so shopmoonlightguidance.com and linked down below there's intention items which have thousands of five star reviews for items such as bracelets necklaces anklets candles sage bundles embroidered cards teas and so much more and there's also as well the rituals which are for various areas of your life for you know money um happiness justice beauty healing love and also for black magic removal protection ritual and so much more so it's all literally on there if you are interested and yeah definitely check it out but um yeah a lot of people have seen amazing results with those and they work on healing your energies this is not magic because i'm not putting your life under that kind of energy and i'm also not putting myself karmically into that whole path of magic because people that practice things like black magic they can actually end up karmically losing everything and creating a lot of problems so this all works with healing your energies which works with the law of attraction which then allows your intention to progress so here we've got distance we've got journey and ocean so there can be some traveling that happens in your near future near future in your near yeah in your near future there's um a, there's some kind of traveling that's going to happen because you've got the world here and also the chariot as well so there's some kind of distance that's going to take place some kind of journey that's going to take place can be across an ocean but i see ocean okay so there's something here to do with a journey in an ocean across an ocean could be a cruise could be you know traveling over it um something to do with an ocean let me know how that resonates with you if you already know about this trip we've got here cat so we've got a jealousy and gossip and this is very much um what i was uh, talking about in regards to um Oh, what was I talking about? I was talking about this in regards to friendships, right? People that don't show up, they don't turn up. Um, just be careful of some jealous friends um, or people in regards to the work environment. They, you know, can be jealous, they can gossip, but actually you're going to move away from that energy. Just right now, be diplomatic, pay them very little of your energy okay i think that's really important and we also have here as well magic curse and witch okay so i do feel like it's important for me to say this as well is that you may find um, that magic has perhaps been slowing down areas of your life black magic is something that is very very um not great like i mentioned right but people have a habit of practicing this or they can do it because they don't want to see you feel happy or strong or good so i would really recommend doing a black magic removal just to make sure that you are removing magic that was placed onto you so that it doesn't affect your abundance which we naturally see here coming through for you okay so it is very possible that um, people that have been jealous of you in the past um, may have placed magic onto you and I would highly recommend getting that removed. So I do offer the black magic removal. It is on my website if you're interested. If you've done one, you don't need to worry about it, especially if you've done the protection ritual, but the black magic removal removes magic. Protection ritual protects you for life against future magic and both of them are really amazing so that you never have to worry about magic again but if you've always just wondered like oh my life is just so chaotic nothing ever goes right um i would really recommend doing a black magic removal because that's something that i see for some of you has really been affecting things and once you remove it it's you and it's just you number one striving forward moving forward with your life without those problems getting in your way or causing conflict 
frustration, pain, things like that. Okay, so I think that's really, really important, but your future really does look very strong. If you found this reading, I really feel like it's for you because that energy there of, you know, which does show here um, some magical energies affecting you in a not very magical way because it's black magic, right? Um, but if you've done a removal, then it shows here, actually, it's affirmed the fact that you removing that has been a very, very good thing to do. So this is your reading. If this resonates with you, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, um, comment down below, let me know. Um, all the information for black magic removals and protection rituals are down in the description box below and on shopmoonlightguidance.com. I also have TikTok and Instagram, by the way, if anyone ever wanted to, um, you know, have a little look on my pages, feel free to do so. I post short readings on there every single day and it's moonlight.guidance on Instagram, moonlightguidance on TikTok, and I'll see you all very soon.